Okay, that's better. All right, so because I'm gonna be doing different, I'm just, I'm keeping all of this fucking bullshit away from my channel. And yes, I'm sorry, but I have grounds to strike FFG. She's a hateful piece of shit. Even just calling someone Koki over and over is shaming. And in the terms of service, it says, you do not attack people for certain things. And girl, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna talk directly to someone at YouTube and be like, there's people who fucking ride my ass. Every time I go fucking live, they're fucking desperate to keep their rent at the Motel 6 and they fucking snipe my shit. Bitch, don't snipe my fucking content or I'm gonna take your shit down. You don't fucking believe me. You are gonna believe me. You wait, you wait. I'm hot enough, I'm done. I'm fucking done with this shit. Done. You stream snipe me the, oh, no, maybe not the last time, but don't worry. Don't you worry, it's coming, bitch, it's coming. Oh, it's coming. No, it's, it's, don't worry, it's coming, it's coming, it's coming. This fucking bitch pretends to be an advocate for fucking DV victims because she was one. Well, you know what? You're a piece of shit because all you do is shame people and call people cokey, cokey, cokey. You really contribute so much to the internet. Fuck you. You're going down, bitch. Yeah, don't worry. I've had enough. <coughs> So, moving on. I don't care if she doesn't call me Koki. I don't care. I was addicted to Coke in the summer and she was calling me Koki. And actually, I have a lot of clips of her being a hateful piece of shit. So yes. So yes. Oh, okay, Kalani, goodbye. Anyone who supports her, put a one in the chat right now. I'll block you. Goodbye. Her... <laughs> I'm gonna go, I should go fucking strike her right now. No, I'm putting her on the fucking TV, giving her attention she wants. <clears throat> it is my fucking content she's stealing. Of course it is. I pay her rent at the Motel 6. You think anyone would listen to her fucking rubber band mouth if she wasn't spewing hate shit about me or Natter? Get the fuck over, get the fuck out of our fucking past relationship. Why are you so fucking obsessed? You're disgusting. Get a life, Jesus Christ. Get an effing life, seriously. She's blah. The only reason anyone goes there, oh, I have 3,000 views. Yeah, because people talk shit about me. You think anyone would care what you're saying? You think anyone would care, really? Nothing, you're a nobody. You're a nobody. Live with that every day. And all I have to do is really take a time out of my no life no life, but I don't even have time to go on to your channel and strike you for fucking being a piece of shit and harassing me. And it's you, you cause harassment. Your channel's like you cause harassment for creators. You know why? And I'm going to argue with that. I'm going to write a friggin' case to YouTube. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. She does call both of us crackheads. And what do you think you look like living in a Motel 6 downtown ghetto Montreal? You don't think you look like a friggin' bigger crap? I'm sorry. But anyways... Crackhead alone, I hate that word. I hate crackhead, cokey. Like, a, what I went through in the summer, just like, I did feel like a piece of shit for being on coke. And I was having, and like, why? Really? Like, you're like, it's disgusting. It's disgusting. Goodbye, EG. Yeah, I don't even want you at all. <laughs> But when you did lose your channel, she followed you to all of the platforms. Exactly. She's full of shit. She'll move on to the next. How about you? These people who react to us are even worse. Like, how are, how are you not the biggest hypocrite loser of all time? What is your your legacy going to be? Oh, I made fun of Chantal and Matter for my whole YouTube career. And I brought some really interesting talking points. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. You really contributed great. Oh, so what? At least this is my own content. <clears throat> you guys are gonna that's the thing that's why i didn't want to i don't want to apologize specifically for these people who are just waiting to use what the cuba thing over and over and over yeah well this person did this as if people don't fuck up and as if people don't have an ugly side and a good side i'm sorry but i'm not letting cuba define me i'm not letting that rage define me as a person i will take ownership and i will apologize for it when i've properly processed it when i'm fucking ready not when you're ready when i am okay so I guess what you're getting what you wanted, a rage. <clears throat> a lot of them talk from a big, lost her channel. Well, here it is. 
That didn't age well, did it? What does rubber band mouth mean? Her mouth is like this when she talks. Cokey, cokey. Cokey. That's what she looks like. I just want to see if you do one video. Well, now they're going to go and watch it just because we say that. Thank you. I'm not going to calm down. I've had enough shit, really. Don't tell me what to do. I don't know if these people are allowed to just steal someone. I don't know how YouTube just like lets it like, they're so like, they're, they have this policy and then they don't enforce it. Like, but I haven't actually time to, I haven't actually time to, you know, taken the time to actually like contact YouTube and be like, like, especially the fucking stream. It's not fair use, goodbye. I don't even care if it is fair use. If they're like, the commentary they're spewing is bullshit. I'm sorry, it, it should be against the rules to have an entire channel about someone else. And as soon as that person goes live, they stream snipe and bully you. Fuck you and fuck that and fuck YouTube if they, if they condone that. And I'm going to make a fucking stink about it. Trust me, it's a long time coming, four years. I know what, maybe I'll take it to the news actually. Yeah, cause it's a problem. It is, it's a problem. <clears throat> I'm sober and if someone called me a pillhead or junkie when I was being sober or trying not to use, it would be pretty hurtful. But she's so helpful. She's so helpful guys. Exactly farmhouse. She's full of shit. <clears throat> I wouldn't get media involved. Well, fuck. Like, ugh, oh, so sickening. Anyway. <clears throat> I don't really do for media. <laughs> Not the news. At least one little thing. No, he's a piece of shit too, Monty. He is. Sorry. He's a bigger piece of shit and he's going down too. <clears throat> she constantly has a split because she's a hypocrite trying to make view money. That's all she is. She's a hypocrite and people eat it up just that she's hateful. Like if you are entertained by that, you should think about your own mental health. Fuck. It's disgusting. Like, I don't know. In a life. Ugh. Thank you, Gail. Cuba was fun, yeah. And I did do a lot of growth in there. Just because you don't see it doesn't matter. Because it doesn't fucking matter what you think. Keep the super chats coming. People hate to see. Yeah. <laughs> the thumbnails are good. But they are mean, I guess. Aw, Flexeru is hurt. Goodbye. I came here from the drama communities and reaction communities. But I'm so grateful I became a beezer and got to know what you're about. And I love you, girl. Me too, damn it, Emma. Thank you. Hate is a lucrative business. Isn't that fucking sad? How do people live like that? Like, how would you serve? How would you even like come online every day and like just shit on someone all, every day? Like, do you not? You some like, fucking full of hot air. Like, uh, it's like beating. It has to be beating the dead horse at this point. Like, I don't know. I don't know how people listen to that shit. I really don't. <clears throat> it's not that deep like people overanalyze stuff i do that like like um someone was analyzing i put a title uh what was the title i don't even know who gives a shit but it's just like it's so over the top sometimes you know what i mean i know gossip is human nature but like god i'm protect like this is my fucking job and like people steal my shit as soon as i come on